Hi Scorpio, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Scorpio, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Scorpio. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Emperor, and this is Aries energy. So this is a card of stability. This is a card of someone who is showing up as very mature in the divine masculine energy. This person may want to take the lead. Um, this is someone who is uh, showing up as quite experienced and compassionate. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the Knight of Swords, Air energy. The Queen of Pentacles, Earth energy. And we have the Knight of Pentacles, Earth Energy. Okay, so there's definitely someone who's, it's like they've got their eye on you, they're focused on you, you're someone they want, so they're seeing you as a prize. Um, there is an energy of wanting to come towards you quite soon, actually, with this Knight of Swords. There may be a lot of communication they want to give here. Um, there's a lot of respect towards you from this person, though. Um, there's there's an energy though that in the past this person may have been a bit stubborn because we have that emperor energy and we also have the king I mean the knight of pentacles and these can be people who are quite set in their ways they can be quite slow moving um, they can be quite uh, you know difficult to convince so it's almost as if this person um, they're going to have to yield to you there's this energy of them having to make some sort of concession here. And with the Knight of Pentacles, um, I mean, the Knight of Swords, there's this feeling of you may have presented yourself as um, not willing to uh, compromise or, you know, given them some sort of a take it or leave it type of energy. Because with the Knight of Swords, that's someone who is um, rushing in to give some sort of an offer here because they fear that they may lose someone or that someone is getting away from them. And with them seeing you as that Queen of Pentacles energy, they are seeing you as valuable and seeing you as someone who, um, you know, someone who knows themselves, someone who knows their worth, someone who is quite on a high pedestal here. Okay, so let's clarify these cards, um, Scorpio. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Judgment card, and this is Scorpio energy. So this is a card of transformation. It's a card of truths, revelations. Um, and again, there's this Judgment call here. It's like someone feels like this is their last chance. They need to um, own up to something or make something happen here. But it's also like uh, the ball is in your court. It's like they are wanting your approval. They are wanting um, your validation here. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the King of Pentacles, Earth Energy. We have the King of Wands, Fire Energy. And we have the Six of Cups in the reverse, Water Energy. So there could be multiple people here who are involved in the situation. Um, again, it's like this is someone who is seeing you as someone who is worth fighting for, someone who is worth compromising for. Um, there could be a fear of competition because we do have a lot of kings here and we have that emperor energy. Um, so I do see someone here who is wanting to um, ground the connection, but they're also ready and willing to kind of let go of an old way of being because you have the six of cups there and it's in the reverse. So it's like some sort of stubborn quality in the past that didn't serve this connection. They're recognizing that they need to release that and there's a willingness on their part to do that. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Scorpio. Okay, we have Believe in the Impossible, Blue Moon. 
So this person is doing something that's quite out of character here. They are really uh, compromising here. Okay, so I'm going to put another card for you. Okay, we have it is safe for you to love open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all okay so this person genuinely loves you they care about you and um they they really are willing to you know make those concessions because you are they feel as if you're the one for them they there's a the willingness to do whatever it takes to keep you here okay so i'm gonna pull out another card for you scorpio Okay, we have cheerfulness it is spring again the earth is like a child that knows poems by heart so there's definitely a, a, a need to reinvent themselves that's how they feel they need to let something go a part of their personality an old quality that they had that was slowing the connection down they are willing to change that they re they're ready to transform okay so i'm gonna pull out a card for your advice scorpio Okay, we have surrendered to success. You are ready to experience abundance. Don't look back at previous roadblocks or difficulties. Leap into an exciting new world of possibilities. So this could be for you. It, it, it looks like you have options here. It looks like you um, you have choices. It's, it's up to you if you want to revisit someone from the past. Um, but I am seeing a lot of people here that you can choose from. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Scorpio. I hope you have a really, really good day, Scorpio. Bye, Scorpio.